The first step to apply to the Institute Advisory Board membership cycle is to create a ResearchNet account. If you already have a ResearchNet account, you may skip this step. On the Institute Advisory Board Membership Application and Guidelines page, click the Register link. This will bring you to the User Profile Registration page. Fill out all the required fields on this form. Please be aware of fields that have specific formatting requirements, like dashes in your phone number. When you have completed all the fields, click Submit. You will be redirected to the Sign In Hyperlink. Click the Sign In Hyperlink and you will be redirected to the ResearchNet Sign In page. Using your email and password, sign into ResearchNet. The next step in the ResearchNet registration process is to register for your CIHR PIN. This is a personal identification number that will be included with your application. To obtain your CIHR PIN, click the upper right tab with your name. From the dropdown, click Register for a CIHR PIN. Fill in your information on the page. Several fields on this form use codes for entries such as country and province. To obtain the code for your entry, click on the note icon located beside the field box. This will bring you to a search page. Type in the name you would like to find and click search. The correct code will appear. Click the code to have it entered into the field box on the main form. Once you have completed all the required fields, click Submit. You will see a confirmation page of your PIN request. Please note that these requests are typically processed within one business day. You will receive an email confirming your PIN request has been processed. You can return to the ResearchNet homepage by clicking Return to your application. The last step to register for your PIN is to validate your CIHR PIN. Navigate to the upper right tab of the homepage that has your name. Click Validate your CIHR PIN. Navigate to the CIHR PIN notification email in your inbox and input the PIN into the field, then click Validate. Finally, click the Return to Homepage hyperlink.